Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forged, one of my three current Battletech series that I'm working on right now. So I've got uh, Cold Forged, I've also got another Rogue Tech series called Funky Steve's Medina's, plus a uh, third series, for instance, a Battletech, Battletech Flashpoint series uh, called the 900. You can check them out on my channel. But anyway, um, so today we're going to do a couple things. First, we're going to have a look at our barracks. So I think a couple of our mech warriors are able to gain some skill here. So for Cold Metal, our main guy, what we want to do is we want to raise up our um, tactics to get called shot bonus. So I'm going to confirm that because I really want to start um, taking out mech's legs and stuff so we can get more mech parts. Um, yeah. Hickory here, uh, she's already got tactician, but we're going to add gunnery skill. I was thinking about maybe going pilot, fire, move, move, fire. Um, but I'm thinking maybe because she's mostly going to be like a long range missile boat, it might be better off having the multi target. So I'm going to go with that route. Training complete. And then pylon, I think, is still fine. Uh, I'm, I'm going to be going for gunnery on him. So I'm going to save my points up for that. Uh, Raider, we're still going to wait. I'm going to get some gunnery, I think, on her. And then Recoil, um, we're going to go with uh, gunnery on him too as well. So I think we want to get him into the multi-target boat because he's uh, getting in real close and doing some good damage. So let's confirm this. Mech warrior training complete. All right, so let's have a look um, at the mech bays real quick. So we've got our first basically um, rebuilt mech now which is a panther a lag unfortunately it has got just a fusion core and the heat sink left so it's since it's the only mech we have right now and i think our lance is running pretty good the way it is i'm just going to put him straight into storage for now we'll bring him out later when we have a few more we can make a second lance um so let's go to the command center and have a look at the contracts so there's really only a couple contracts i think we can do here Payroll seizure is one of them, and we're going to try this one first. Now, this is a recovery mission, so I think we can probably get in and out if we had to. Uh, but it is one and a half skulls, so it could be difficult. You've seen what the half skull missions look like. You've seen what the one skull missions look like. If we get it run into trouble, we could just be, you know, pummeled to death. We may need to withdraw. And I'm going to save the raiding party for second. Uh, if we do well in this one, we'll do raiding party today. If we don't do well in this mission, then we're most likely, like if we bail and we have, you know, we haven't been pummeled, we'll do raiding party. But if we complete this mission and we need to repair or we need to leave after taking heavy damage, then we're just going to leave the planet and leave raiding party alone. So we're going to go ahead and do payroll seizure right now. So let's negotiate this. We're going to go full salvage. Um, we have engines and stuff we can sell if we don't, uh, you know, if we have to pay out a lot to repair stuff. And we've got enough right now for the end of the month. And we still got 19 days left, so let's accept this. And once again, going with our standard lance, deploy, and let's get this done. Command interface initiated. All right, here we go. Okay, so this one's going to be a little tricky. All right, so. Okay, let's just get this done. Yeah, no, I hear you. Okay, so we got to recover here and leave here. Chances are we're going to move up. There's going to be a Lance of Mechs. There may be turrets. There may not be. Uh, and there may be reinforcements. So we're going to do... The last thing I want to do is move down here and not have any kind of be able to move around. So we're going to move around this side here. Going to reserve so we can all move together. Right let's get recoil going first. Hey, let's see what this baby can do. You already know what it can do, buddy. All right, Hickory. Yep. All right, full speed. So the name of the game with this one is like slow progression. Use the train to your advantage. I mean, that's, you know, using the train to your advantage is obvious, but in this particular map, it's so much easier than on the other ones. Because just shifting a little bit left or a little bit right when you're back here can like block so much here. All right, so we're going to keep moving up here. We're going to halt right here. Any further than this, and we're going to detect stuff, so... What do you need? Roger. Commander. Double time. Let's go. Thank God for fast max, man. Alright, let's get right up here. 
All right, recoil on this side. On my way. Hickory on this side. Got it. I got a feeling there's not any mechs up here. Something's just saying that it's going to be turrets and then reinforcements. But I'm expecting there's going to be at least one heavy mech. Roger that. Sneak a little closer here. Yeah, usually there's like a mech here and a couple over here and then one back here, so... Alright, let's reserve. I want to go back past uh, if there's any turrets or anything, so I want to get right back, back to turn one. Okay, Rico, you're going first. Let's get up as far as you can get here, just about. Okay, looks like a turret. Doesn't look like any mechs. Yeah. Yeah. So I think I'm right. Maybe it is just turrets. Yeah, we don't want to get Hickory in too far. I can't risk those uh, medium range tens. Confirmed. Let's keep the left side. No, it is a mech. So there is no turrets. Looks like we're up against mechs. Yes, Commander. Okay, Pylon. You got the armor, so let's get up in here. Get in front of the light mechs. And then cold metal. Right straight down the center here if we can. Alright, let's see what they do here. So that's a light mech. So it's probably going to be one lance and then a second lance is reinforcements. He didn't move far enough to make his worth his while. Let's see what else we got here. Yeah, there's mediums. And a heavy. Oh, it's a vehicle though. As long as it's not like a demolisher or something. The one thing I'm noticing a lot, of, like a huge lack of right now, Receiving. is the um, Saladin mech, or Saladin vehicle. Move order received. So it's two vehicles and a stinger. Okay, cool. So this isn't so bad. I'm going to leave a small laser off. I'm going to manage heat a little early. Okay, it's not a fully armored one either. Which makes me wonder what... Uh, what else could be coming up later? I want to get in with the dead fire ammo early. I want to blast this guy. Soften him up for my light boys. Well, boys and girls. Because they can get right in here. So there's the other guy back there. Let's make short work of this guy for sure. Bang, you're dead. Okay, so he didn't even get to shoot. Let's get you into here for now. Keep you safe. One light, one medium, one heavy. Let's reserve. We've got some good chevrons, so I'm not that worried. We don't... That's a vehicle, okay. I thought for a second that that was just one of those little uh, things. Alright. Waiting for the shot. AC carrier. I think he's got one of those ballistic targeting computers. Go. I'm gonna walk it into here. On the move. Get in the trees and then just open up on this guy. Like, I think he's got a TTS. Anyways, we're gonna fire everything on him. Uh, we're going to attempt to fire on him, that is. Uh, okay. Uh, cold metal. What's the chance to hit here? Well, it's only light rifle, so we need to sprint. Wow. Uh, what do we want to do here? I think we're going to give up our shooting turn. I'm going to move into over here. I'm going to give ourselves a little bit of a target. Yeah. And we'll do... Actually, you know what? Let's not get too close. And we'll use the MRMs. Just inside range here, I think. Come on, where's the target? There we go. 
this fire. Okay, now recoil. How are we doing here? Not bad. I mean, like, pretty good chance to hit. And he's fast, too, right? So let's get right in here. He's going to move next. Move and shoot, shoot, and move. Wow, you only hit with one, eh? No, that wasn't heavy damage, dude. All right, recoil. Yeah. What can I do you for? Let's target this guy again, and turn out the two smalls, and fire. I'll make them Come on, that better be it. Are you serious? Nice. Nice? We're talking about nice, dude. You should be dead by now. Let's get back here. At least Hickory should be able to finish him up from range. She doesn't even need to move. She's just going to fire from here. Yeah, we've done some pretty significant damage, but not quite enough. Let's fire everything. There we go. Move her down. Yeah, man. Light LRM carrier. So let's get in there and deal with that if we can. This is probably going to be bad chances to hit, but I'm thinking we can use our other guys to push it. Well, maybe not a bad chance to hit. Look at that. I was going to say we could use our other guys to push him back a turn. So that's it for that. Alright, Pylon, I want you to grab the scientist this turn. Excellent. Urban mech. All right. Ready for order. Seventy-four percent. Yeah, you know what? We're just gonna walk it over. Save some heat. I'm gonna open up on this guy. Fire everything. So I'm thinking on this map, there might be reinforcements from the left-hand side back over here behind the. Uh, like they might get dropped over here. Yep. So let's get you to come into here Let's move. and dump some missiles on this guy. Let her rip. Nice. Got past the armor. Nice. Uh So let's shoot from the front, I guess. Now it's Make sure we're kind of more on the... Well, I can't really get to his side, unfortunately. So if we can't get to his side, can we just move somewhere to hit him? Nope. Gotta run it. Gotta run it. Let's get over here. It's only got an AC-10. Only. Bang. You're not quite dead, but you're almost dead. Bang, you're almost dead. Okay, just walk it over here. Dump some medium lasers into this guy. There we go. That could be it. We can salvage that. Mission. That's it. Wow. That was a one and a half skull. That was some pretty easy experience, man. We're doing the half skull mission now after all. Let's just fix our max and jump right into it. I don't think we took much damage. Got lots of XP though, like 750. That's a good chunk for us. All right, what are we taking? We got three parts here. Uh, God, TTS ballistic for sure. No specialty ammo. How much are these things worth? 250,000 for the internal combustion. 150 for these. I'm taking two of these and we're just gonna sell them. So we did get the two mech parts, a couple of AC-2s. Oh, LRM-10s, nice. Okay. So let's fix our mechs, and then we're going to jump right into the half skull mission and knock that one off too. And then next episode, we'll travel to a new planet and hopefully knock off a bunch more. I'm almost tempted to try a two skull mission. If I can find a recuckle missions with like 10 mechs is kind of tough. So they have like a heavy mech in it, and then you handful of guys, so... 
All right, Steel Viper took New Kent from Wolf. So two things we're going to do. We're going to fix... We don't have anything to fix. We didn't take any damage on that. Did they even shoot at us? I can't even remember if they shot at us now. Wow. Uh, okay. Let's look at the store real quick. It's probably changed by now. Yeah, it's, so this stuff's changed. Anything in here we want? Um, fluid gun oil. Stability damage. Uh, SRM 6 plus. Uh, not a lot we really want. Patchwork materials are nice, but we can't really do it indirect. No. Um, there's precision ammo, but we can't use any of it right now. Oh, there it is. There's the LRM Artemis ammo. I'm going to buy that. And then we'll quickly sell those two internal combustion engines we just picked up. Look at this. We've got seven AC2s. Let's sell all of them. We don't need them. Okay, let's go down. We don't need a large laser minus. And there is... Uh, where are you? Rocket Launcher 15. We don't really need... Um, vehicle flamers we got through. I'll just hang on to them for now. Where are those internal combustion engines? There's two of them. See, 32,000. It's not, not bad. All right, so we got enough money now to to uh, continue over. So we're going to have to start looking at loadouts. Like, it might be nice to use the Artemis and the Artemis ammo. Let's put a couple of LRM-10s in that Jenner. So if we can find some bonus LRM-10s or something. Um, we've got a couple of them right now that we can just throw in. So we'll have a much better chance to hit. But that's just a thought for the future. But right now, let's get, let's get rolling here on the next uh, contract. So we're going to do Raiding Party right away. Battle in the Desert, Inbound Dropship. Hopefully um, it's only one Lance, but it might be two. We'll see. I'm going to go full salvage because we're still doing really well for the month. I'm actually surprised that we didn't take... Oh, we got to wait five days. <laughs> oh, it's so much... It's so sad when your pilots are fatigued and, like, longer than it takes to fix your mechs. All right, there we go. Now let's go do the contract. Got to rest for five days, I guess. Taking five days off, going down to the planet and indulging in some of those hallucinatory vegetations. Alright, here we go. So these guys dropped in to there. What does that look like to you? I have no idea. Hunchback? Maybe? find out soon enough well, this is a hell it most certainly is we're going up this way uh, let's get uh, let's reserve I want to get uh, pylon first here got to get it in such a way we can all get up here in good order okay pylon first and hickory We're going to take the high road. I find every time I go on this map that I try and take the low road along here, I get pasted, so... But every time I take the high road, it's a little, little better. Right, let's just get to here. Okay, let's sprint you up here. Wait for everybody else. Nah, no sense in going too far. Centurion's really slow. What's up, boss? All right, let's get moving. Let's get moving. Okay, let's reserve. Reserving action. And again. And one more time. It's just if I'm able to spot somebody. I'm hoping that they've already reserved. So let's hey, move up. Let's uh, no blips yet. Yep. Okay. Good to go. Roger. God, this Phoenix Hawk's so fast. I almost want to drop his engine, but then he's so ridiculously fast that it's it's so beneficial. Okay, so I'm going to reserve, then I'm going to move 
um, cold metal up here and brace. Then I'm going to reserve back, and then we're all going to move in. I don't want that guy. I don't want my um, centurion just out of range. Holding and cooling. When we encounter the enemy, I want him to be there. Okay, once again, reserve him back to turn one. Okay, recall, you're up. Let's get in here. See what we can see. Just going to move up and we're going to brace. Let's draw them out. Let's res oh, we can't reserve. So we're not going to reserve. Uh, Pylon, let's get you... Can we get to a spot where we can see that guy from over here? Let's get to a spot where we can see him. Maybe we can lay some missiles on him. What do we got down here? It is a hunchback. AC-20 back. Okay, well... Mortars and grenade launchers into this guy till he's gone. And then we'll deal with everybody else afterwards. Failed to connect. Yeah, I saw that. Yep. Let's make sure you stay evasive. Confirmed. Make sure those MMRs are turned away from him. Or MRMs, sorry. Fire them on him. Okay, he's fully armored. See, this is the weird thing. Like, this is the half skull mission. And, like, let's get you out here. And the last mission was, like, you know, one and a half. And, like, this guy should have been in that mission, but whatever. All right, firing on him. Let's give him a bit of a wake up call. Let them know we're headhunting for them. So they got two lights, a medium, and a heavy. So let's hope the heavy is the uh, catapult. I'd like to get three catapult parts out of this, but uh, I know it's yeah. probably unlikely, but it would be nice. Uh, now the question is, is do we close with this guy and give him optimal range to fire at us in the hopes that we could take this torso before he gets a chance to do that? And that's unlikely, I think. So since he is slow, we can't see this guy yet. I'm going to reserve. going to give it a reserve. I don't think I want to push him so much. Let's see what they do here. I'm going to reserve it back. I don't want to go all the way back to turn zero in case we want to try and reserve again. Okay, so I'm turning this way. First, I'm going to fire everything on this guy. Hopefully we put up some big numbers on him. Not bad. He's going to move now. Okay, he's making it difficult for us to target the side now, unless we move in. So we're going to do that. We will indulge him. Uh, I can't, what, I can't get down in there? I thought you could go through here. I guess you can't. So we're going to do this then. I don't know what this guy is yet, but he could be the heavy mech. Let's fire on this guy's side. Uh, I'm going to leave these two smalls off for now. Wow. I think this guy's the heavy mech over here. This is what, urban mech? R10? No, that's a what? Hoping that's a rocket launcher, not a missile launcher. Thunderbolt. Alright, so that's the crap... That's the uh, light rifle urban mech. This guy's got two MRN10s. Okay, so he's the standard one we've been facing. Uh, let's get Pylon down here. All in ass. I really want to take this torso off. Let's just fire on him. Giving him everything I've got. Hit, okay, I think Hickory's gonna have to do a do a uh, precision strike. So we got a Commander One B. Not worried about that guy now. All right, so we do need to do a precision strike on the Hunchback to push him back a turn, so we can all go before him again. The Thunderbolt can be dangerous, but I don't think it's as need? dangerous as that AC-20 back. So we're gonna turn in here like this, got it. and we're gonna do. Uh, Offensive push, 
gonna try for this torso and we're gonna fire everything. Once again, I'm not expecting to take the torso, I just want to push him back a turn. So now we can all go before him. The dead fire ammo I'm hoping is going to do the job here. Uh, so recoil. Let's leave that thunderbolt for now. Um, you know what? We're going to reserve. I'm thinking pylon, I want to get to go first. To see if we can take that torso. Where are you going? That's like suicide against the Centurion. Or well, my Centurion, anyway. Uh, 55 and 19. So 19 left in the arm. We should be able to do it. We're going to move out here. Uh, just going to turn enough. Just have to hit the arm once. Uh, let's leave off the small. We'll follow the rest. That. that should do it. That was a torso hit. Are you serious? Commander. All right, we're gonna fire a move. So we're just gonna shoot this guy. That should do it. There we go. So we don't have to worry about the AC twenty now. Critical hit coming. There it goes. Goodbye. And we will move around to here, just so that thunderbolt can't see us. All right, so this guy has gotten really nothing left. He can still melee, but not that worried about it. Let's take the large off of this. What's our chance to hit back here? 71. So we're going to move back here, and we're going to dump everything on this commando and maybe take him out of the match. Oh, not quite. Hickory might be able to finish it up though. Yeah. So let's step back over here. Understood. Dump everything on this guy. Here goes the right torso. Pilot injured. Yeah. Not quite a knockdown, so he's gonna move first. Nope. Here comes the hunchback. Oh, that's right, because he uh, hasn't gone yet. Yeah, I thought I thought that coming. I saw that coming. And here comes the MRMs. Weak. Okay, so now who do we want to finish this hunchback up with? It's got like no back armor. CT hasn't been penned yet. So we want to burrow through. Tell you what. Let's use him to finish up this guy. Uh, I think we should be able to do it with just this. Actually, you know what? Let's make sure. Yeah, I think it was good that we added those two other smalls. One less time. Okay, making sure that guy's gone. Urban mechs are normally terri terrifying, but that guy back there, not so much. I mean, you can still put out some damage if you're not careful on them, but um, Let's move. not as much as some of the other ones. Okay, we're going to start trying to take this guy apart. This should be... Not expecting a head hit, but I'm hoping for one. Yeah, see? Hmm, turning his torso. Smart move. Commander. Let's get back around to here. Because we're going to rotate the Centurion back up now. So let's get in on this guy. We're gonna turn off these three mediums and just go with the one small or one medium. Wow, nice. Did that pen the did that pen the center torso? No, it just goes to the CT armor, okay. Um Do I wanna finish this guy up? I think I do. 
Let's do this. Let's try and remove this guy from the board. I'm just gonna fire everything straight on him. Okay, he's not having a good day. It's an MRM-10 fight now. What's up, Commander? All right, recoil. Can we get up beside? Can we get up beside that guy? We can't. Um. Boy, oh boy, he's unsteady. I want to take advantage of this. Oh, he's only got 16 left in the CT. Well. Full speed, no shoot. Let's finish him up. Uh, we'll leave everything on just in case. Okay, nice. Two down. I wonder if this uh, Thunderbolt's wondering if that urban mech was like even worth having in their company. It's like, dude, you gotta hit something. Okay, we're gonna move back into the trees here. Get our stability back that we lost a little bit of. Do an offensive push. Still got lots left. Gonna try for a headshot. Turn off a medium laser. Firing. Confirmed. I know. Oh, we got a head hit. Good. I know we're gonna end up probably blowing that guy up. It's kind of frustrating, but that's probably what's going to end up happening. Okay, offensive push. Once so again, go for the headshot. Not quite. Ready for orders. Pylon. Confirmed. And offensive push. I think we're going to try for the leg this time. How much can we get in here? Just fire these four. Eh. Alright, let's see what he does. Nice one. Okay, we're gonna back off on damage now. So Hickory, yep. still gonna move a little bit here. Not a whole lot. We've got broken line of sight here. Here we go. Turning like this. Gonna turn off the medium lasers. Once again, another offensive push. Looking for this guy's head. Firing. Nope. We're gonna end up blowing this guy up. Splash damage just doesn't work. Okay, Recall, that guy's all yours. Something I can do. Yep. On my way, double time. Um, I guess we're doing this. Locked on time. Nice. Solid connection on that one. Nice. Okay, um, we're gonna strip this guy's armor bad. Still got a fair bit though. I mean we could waiting for orders. Let's come in from this side, I think. See if we can make him unstable. Roger that. A knockdown would be nice nice. So he's down to three health. So if we knock him down. Putting my weight into it. Take a torso, that'll be one. And all we need is just an er erroneous head hit here. Okay, uh, so let's make you shoot for me. Okay, I'm just going to rotate slightly, and we're going to do an offensive push. going to try for the head again, leaving these guys off. Okay, what's the stability at? Nothing. <sighs> yeah, what can I do, you fool? Let's attack this guy again. Let's fire with 
These guys? Ah, uh, just leave the small off because we gotta move. Roger that. Okay, cool. Oh, nice hit on that one. Nice hit. Okay, now let's move you here. Uh, Hickory. Yeah. I think she's got probably a better chance to take the head. We're running out of resolve here. Headshots, firing. Come on, plank it. No. I guess it's, I don't know, if we can try a melee and knock him down or something. We just don't have the juice here. Let's attack him from behind. Might get lucky and hit a leg here. Oh, there's the arm and the torso. There's another pilot injury. Oh. Well. Okay. I would, uh, all right. Hope we got some salvage out of that. Let's finish this guy up. Bang, you're dead. All right, well. Mission. I don't know what I punched him. I don't think, I thought I took his arm off. I'm surprised his torso blew up too. It must have just like an ammo explosion or something. I don't think he, I th oh, I was right. I think he had his, he might've had his MRM ammo in that torso. All right, so do we take any component damage? I don't think so. We did pretty well. The uh, Centurion took a big hit. I should have moved in that turn, but I wanted him to shoot for the Centurion. Yeah, so we only got one Thunderbolt part. Oh, well. Um, this is worth how much? 90 grand. Not worth anything. Uh, so is there anything down here that we want? Doesn't look like it. Wow. Wow, that's really bad. So this is... These are expensive. This and this will take. Oh, well, that's it. Alright. Oh, we got all four mech parts. Excellent. So we got the Thunderbolt part. Cool. Hunchback part, commando, urban mech part. All right, and junk. Hmm, Davian took Lachlan from Tortuga. Skip Tana from Tortuga, really? All right, so not a bad improvement on the design. So what do we get here? We got the urban, we got an urban mech. All right, cool. So that's like two mechs in, in, in like two days here. 20 grand. Excellent. Okay, let's see what that thing's got. It's the RX-60. So, we don't really have a fusion core for this guy, unfortunately. It's got nothing in it. Look at this thing. So, yeah. It's the AC-10 version, but still, you know what? It's not bad. You know what? We might be able to put the uh, heavy um, machine gun array in this thing. And with a bigger engine, maybe. I don't know. Alright, so we're going to leave it like this. Let's repair this. 56,000 in seven days. Let's confirm it. Right. I'll get it. Alright, so we got a bit of work to do. Let's just uh, reallocate this a little bit, I think, which will be a bit better. So, we got 12 days before our next financial report. So, while we're repairing this stuff, uh, we're going to move systems since we pretty much cleaned up what we can do here. And let's go to the star map. I think there's a system that's like 11 days away. And we'll repair our ship here before the next episode. That's 13, 21. It was one that was 11, I think. Some are close. 18, 16. Where was it here? 12, 14, 10 days. That's, well, that's, I think it was up here maybe. Yeah, there's a Hillerod. Uh, large population manufacturing, rich travel hub. What's this one got? Former Star League presence, Comstar presence, Intersphere civilization, manufacturing mega city. I think this one's the better of the two. Porima. So we're gonna go there. By your command. So yeah. So now that we've got two new mechs, starting on our way for our second lands, it's excellent. We just need to get some heavier mechs. That's all. Um, triple F burgers, eh? Let's try and sell them on the market. Yeah, hey, we're, we're getting 10 grand. Cool. Covers part. 
You never know with triple F burgers and what you're going to get out of them. So, uh, yeah, when we get to the next planet, we're going to take a few more missions there. We're on our way to getting our next Lance up and running. Um, Panther and Urban Mech, I'm not sure what else we're going to have. Um, hoping that we, we've got five pieces of a catapult right now. So I'm hoping we encounter another one of those catapults so we can take some pieces for that. Uh, or hopefully we get some pieces for that. Um, I think we've got a lot of spider pieces. Uh, we've got a few Wolverine pieces I know that we have, so hopefully we can find a Wolverine and get max salvage out of that. But we'll see. Alright, so we're here. Um, quick view in the store. And see if there's anything. ER large laser, don't really want it. Like Gauss rifle. Oh, clan LRM 15s. We just, I'd have to sell a whole lot to get these. Even one would be nice. Thunderbolt 5s. 25 damage though for 3 tons. It's not really that worth it. Well, they, they do have good range. Clan Feral Lemur. Look at this. Protective padding. TTS Ballistic plus 2. Increased range. Decreased minimum range. Crazy. Anything else down here that we can use? Dead fire ammo, any or SRM dead fire ammo? No. Alright, so let's... Those clan LRM 15s though. Let's see if we can sell some stuff to pick those up. So we're not going to use this. Um, can sell one of our large lasers, I think. And... Don't need this many LRM 10s, let's sell three. Mag shot we'll keep. Medium lasers, we don't need this many. Let's just sell five. We're not going to have enough cash for this. We're not going to need the machine guns. Actually, let's just sell three. We'll hang on to two just in case. PPC we'll keep. Small lasers, we don't definitely don't need this many. Hang on to four of them. SRM 2s, SRM 4s. Uh, I don't... Well, they're not going to get much for those. Thunderbolts you definitely want to keep. Vehicle flamers. Let's sell all of these. Don't really need them. 227,000. Nice. Um, DNI cockpit we want to keep because we want to add that to one of our mechs. The 180 we're probably going to be adding to the urban mech. This will be going in the Panther probably. So we could sell the 215. Um, we're still not going to have enough. We'd have to sell so much stuff. Yeah. I, don't, I just don't think it's worth it. It's nice to get it, but I think we'll have to wait. I think we'll have to wait, unfortunately. Because we could sell the fusion core, but then we wouldn't have enough for the end of the month. Um, yeah, so we'll just leave it, unfortunately. Would have been nice, but uh, not much we can really do about it. Urban Mech back in one day. And we're going to put him into the reserve for now. So we're not paying for him at the end of the month. Move everything else into storage. Perfect. So... Um, we're going to end the episode here for today. If you liked the video, drop a like on it. Uh, feel free to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Also, check out my two other series, um, Funky Steve's Cold... Ma or, sorry, <laughs> Funky Steve's Medina's, um, which is another Rogue Tech series that I've got running. It's sort of a pirate kind of series, and also my uh, Battletech Flashpoint series that's running right now called The 900. You can find them both on my channels. But until next time, we'll see you all later.